We're calling Castillo a dictator. This and doesn't change how president. I feel about La Mora. He's a monster. But it does mean I can repair some of the damage they've done. got our next move. We fought off a lot of soldados to get those supplies here. Which means... Those medical supplies will put a lot of guerrillas back together. Gracias. Lucky appreciates them too. Even if she doesn't show it. And bringing La Moral was smart. This camp needs young blood. Shakes things up. Now we need to work on Lorenzo. Half the abuelos out there hang on his every word. Honron said Lorenzo should visit a BioVira facility. But getting Lorenzo to do anything is like pulling a tank through the mud sideways. I'm going to give him a little reminder of what we stood for. And you are going to bring the BioVita to him. All you got to do is tiptoe in, take photographs of anything suspicious, and get out. For a so-called research facility, they have way more guns than lab coats down there. They're hiding something, baby Tigre, and we're going to slap Lorenzo in the face with whatever it is. I'm used to Hope you have good camera skills. So what do you kids say? No filter? That's one of the saddest things. Don't feel sad. Go so you know. Tell. All the electricity in this area comes from the electrical station nearby. So, of course, the military took it over. As long as they are there, it's bad news for all of us. Be careful if you go that way. Gracias. Someone I want you to look for. Who? Her name's Gabriella. She's a girl from the fishing village. Used to bring us food and supplies. Lorenzo used to tease her for her tattoos and her crazy hair colors. We loved her visits. Until one day she told us she had some good news and said she'd be leaving Yara. That was the last time we saw Gabriella. My neighbor thought he saw her at that BioVira place. Tattoos and colorful hair. I'll keep an eye out. Gracias. I'm worried something terrible has happened. Gotta take out that alarm. I see you, engineer. Anyone who questions Presidente Castillo is not a true yara. His dream 
What is going on here? What are they doing with their bodies? Sounds came from in there. I've got a bad feeling about this place. Shit about treating cancer. What are they doing to these people? Sonio. They're using humans like rats. What are they testing? Castillo's not going to get away with this. I need more pigs. look like cages but or what these people are sick really sick pinga that must be gabriella pinga pinga what the fuck are they doing to these poor people I need more pigs. <laughs> what is that red smoke? There's something under the water. What the fuck is in the lake? Pal carajo. So many dead bodies in the water. This should be enough to convince Lorenzo.
El Tigre, I've got the pics. You won't believe what they're doing to our people. It's horrific. Oh, I believe it. But it's Lorenzo who needs convincing. And what about Gabriella? I don't know what to tell you. She's gone. Uh, I had a feeling. Okay, get those photos back to camp. It's time for Lorenzo to wake up. We were just kids, El Tigre. <laughs> Lorenzo, I took pictures of that place Honron was talking about. You swipe to the left. They look free to you. Yeah. This is what Libertà and La Moral are fighting. You can hate us, but at least we're doing something about it. No one deserves this, Lorenzo. This is happening all over Yara. You just can't see it from so high up this mountain. I can't look at this anymore. I didn't vote for Castillo. The war is over. So that was a waste. That's the bien. You shoot the tree. Keep that beast away from me. 